Happy March 12th, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 Quest Calendar by Sundial Games, the Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, hoping for some rest and relaxation, Ivy went for a meal and some company at a tavern called the Needy Stick. She lent Vinny, the nearly world-famous swashbuckling squirrel, 10 amber, and he came away from a game of recruits with 12. And uh, also, unfortunately, one angry rabbit who accused him of cheating. Ivy stepped in to try to calm things down and got a fist in the face for her trouble. Uh, H.I. Twins Dad, or uh, Hi Twins Dad, or Hawaii Twins Dad, I'm not sure, Twins Dad, sorry, uh, pointed out the error of my ways on the Discord server and... Yeah, on closer examination, I didn't do the, gaze, the uh, dice game correctly at all. It should have been... Uh, let's see here. We should have spent... So this is what I did do. We did five rounds. Um, and I should have spent two on every round to play. This was my intention. And then on these rounds where we lost, we just lose the... The, our bet, our two amber. And in these rounds where we won, we have a net positive of two. So we lose ten and we gain eight, which means we're down two overall. So we should be at 21 amber, not 25. Uh, so the question remains, and it's beginning to dawn on Ivy, as she rubs her aching beak. How did Vinny come away with all that amber? A weasel and a tipsy porcupine brush past Ivy on her way out, on uh, their way out, and uh, the weasel whispers, y your friend did cheat, you know. Vinny gives Ivy a sheepish grin and a shrug. Ivy takes a step toward the rabbit. She wants to return the money, but the three of them Vinny, the weasel, and the porcupine, wiser in the ways of the tavern than Ivy, escort her out. <laughs> and the weasel says, I think this crowd is best left to its cups. And the pair walks off. Ivy gives Vinny a reprimanding glare. Vinny says, sorry boss, won't happen again. Ivy is pretty sure it will happen again. So, <laughs> now... Let's hope for a better adventure on the calendar for us today. Okay. It's dark when you leave the Needy Stick Tavern. The night is calm as you take a quiet stroll around the residential district. Most celebrations and activities have ended, but there are still a few things to see. Explore the city at night. Uh, it's a cool image. I don't see any hidden icons on here, so let's just get into it. Locked out. You find a tortoise trying to get inside their home after a long day's work. They have broken their key and can't seem to get past the door lock. Choose to either uh, A, B, C, uh, B, that should probably be D. Four options here, I think. Help the tortoise by fixing the key with magic. By using a spell slot or surge available, we do have uh, we have two surges. We could use, I guess, it's going to let us use a surge. Um, we could also pick the lock. Reminder, locksmith. We don't have that attribute. We could try anyway, but uh, help the tortoise by breaking down the door. <laughs> Reminder, athlete. We are an athlete. We get uh, plus two to all rolls to overcome physical and athletic hurdles um but but that seems a little uh we're gonna break the door um or rob them <laughs> we could rob the tortoise uh let's not let's uh i think we'll do this help the tortoise by fixing the key with magic using a surge available so there must be <laughs> Mm, the suspicious player in me is thinking there's something later on this page that we're going to need our surges for. Um, yeah, I do see combat down here. Great. Okay, well, anyway, you magically restore the key 
in a mesmerizing display. The tortoise is very pleased and hands you three amber. Okay. 20, we're up to 28 amber with our dirty money. <laughs> the tavern. Oh boy. Okay, so that's it. The tortoise is happy. We've got him in his home. He can relax. Moving on. Lonely bug. An old and lonely caterpillar crosses your path. It struggles to move and tries to get your attention. Roll d20 plus wisdom reminder bug tamer. Um, d20. 13. Our wisdom is 0. Um, if the result is 10 or more, the bug is hungry and anxious. It beckons you over to an alley behind a tree. Suspecting a family of other hungry caterpillars awaits, you follow it. However, it is a trap. But we rolled high on our wisdom. <laughs> so, so much for wisdom, I guess. Um, it's a trap as a shadowy figure emerges from the alley with daggers drawn. It rushes towards you, slicing wildly with its daggers. D20 attack, roll damage, roll D20 defense. Okay, well, it's got a defense of 13. Our attack is five. Um, 11 plus five is 16, we hit it. Uh, we wanna do at least five damage. We've got a D12, where's my D12? Anything that can help us with damage? Um, Vinny. <laughs> Is Vinny wounded? I forget. We better check before we rely. Well, it might be time. Yeah, he is wounded. And if he takes another wound, he'll, he'll leave the party. Oh, boy. Well, and that's... Uh, we do have... We can use our surge on the solar flare. So we'll do that if we need it. Five. We uh, we don't even need it. We took care of this shadowy figure uh, with its wildly slicing daggers. If you defeated the attacker, you take three amber from the body. The bug appears grateful. Okay, so the bug wasn't in on this. This was the bug is hungry and anxious. It beckons you over to an alley behind a tree. Um, maybe the bug was being manipulated or something by this. Maybe we just, uh, saved this bug from, this caterpillar from some kind of life of crime it was trapped in. I guess is what happened. 28 plus 3 is 31 amber. Wow. Okay. I don't know. I've been impressed by that amount before, but other people... Playing this game seems to have a lot more amber. This is not, this marker is not writing well. Maybe because I'm erasing so much. It writes better down here. Nope, it's dying. Okay, 31 amber. We're going to write it in blue. Let's try again. 31 amber. We could have gained some virtue on here in a couple other ways, but we didn't. That's okay. 31 amber. All right, well, that, my friends, is March 12th. So, we shall say goodbye for today and visit Ivy and friends again tomorrow. I hope you'll join us. Thanks for watching.